Hey y'all, hey, it's your girl Trudy Camilla. I hope you guys are doing well. Happy Saturday. It's a beautiful day outside where I'm at. Y'all know I'm in Georgia. All right, <laughs> I'm in Georgia, so it's very pretty outside. Um, and I hope you guys are doing well, uh, doing your, running your errands. If you're off today, if you're not off, hopefully you're having a good day at work. But I have two jobs for y'all, two jobs y'all with bonuses, all right? So I wanted to hurry up and get these to y'all because y'all need to hurry up and apply and get these bonuses, okay? So first job is CVS. Now I've talked to you guys about this job several times on this channel already, but CVS is hiring, okay? So this one has a $3,000 bonus. This one has a $3,000 per a bonus it's a permanent work from home okay and um, candidates that live in the US can apply now they're saying that it's only uh, Pacific Mountain Time and Central Time but look all right y'all look I'm just here to tell you apply anyway okay apply anyway now you do get a thousand dollar sign-on bonus, your uh, as well as an additional two thousand dollar bonus after your start date, 180 days after your start date. Okay, so in total, it's a three thousand dollar bonus. So this is pretty good. Now they are hiring um, for the position as a Medicare retiree solution customer service. Okay, so. Um, basically they want to you know you're going to be educating plan benefits utilizes compliant documentation standards provides empathetic and mem member uh, centric service utilizes compl complaint documentation standards it seeds our members expectation um, is our standard ensure that every member is shown respect kindness and all questions are thoroughly answered and resolved so the typical pay range for this position it starts at seventeen dollars and two cents and it goes up to twenty seven dollars okay and sixteen cents so people keep in mind that the range represents the pay range for all positions in the job grade the actual salary offer will take into account a wide range of factors including location okay as well as probably experience and all of that in education um, so your qualifications is be able to you know uh, demonstrate empathetic and compassion be empathetic and compassionate ability to apply patience adaptability basic computer skills typing all those type things okay um, now they do have a COVID vaccine requirement so make sure you read over that and then again the preferred qualifi qualifications are customer service education they're only asking for a high school diploma or GED so um, y'all this is a pretty good position with CVS make sure you apply the next job is with the American Express now I have talked about this job on this channel a few times okay this is a virtual customer care professional all right now they're saying may include a bonus um, but when you go if you go on this interview you need to ask them about this bonus okay because they're saying it's a two thousand dollar sign on bonus okay they're really needing people for this position okay um, so your roles and responsibilities are help propel your team and its business partners to success uh, deliver ex extraordinary service on inbound calls consult with card members continuously improve on key selling skills including building rapport understanding customer needs and all of that address general and account specific customer inquiries use tools and resources meet and exceed performance goals that include but are not limited to limited to customer survey results sales rates quality goals, compliance regulations, and productivity um, targets. All right. So um, the, I believe this one does, uh, you, they give you the equipment for this one. Okay. But all you need is, you know, the internet, but they'll, they'll 
give you the equi equipment. Now it says American Express would also make available a one-time reimbursement of up to $100 for any setup fees you incur with your provider. Okay. So these are some of the additional requirements that they are asking for. Um, secure home office, residence in one of the states where we are currently hiring and they are not hiring in Alaska, Hawaii or California unfortunately. Flexible to work a 24-7 hour shift um, may include night and weekends, high school diploma, okay uh, and it so it says the sign on bonus eligible requirements. The sign-on bonus will be paid to eligible, eligible individuals in three installments. So $500 after three months of active employment, $500 after six months of employment, and then $1,000 after 12 months. All right. So it looks like they have this, have, you know, the, the bonus going out in installments. Okay. So the sign-on bonus is contingent on eligible colleagues being actively employed, enrolled, and remaining in good standing. All right. So I will definitely, you know, if you do land an opportunity with them, um, I would definitely be like, hey, what's up with the bonus? Okay. <laughs> don't let them shice. Don't 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 let them shice you on this bonus. Now, as far as the pay for this, I believe this one was like twenty dollars an hour. They don't have the pay on here but this one was at least twenty dollars an hour i'm trying to look and i don't see it but um but yeah i think this would be a good position um bank jobs i've worked at a bank uh back in the day did call serve call center service and it was good i mean of course you know you're gonna get some people a little bit upset about their money but it's not like other call centers where you have like calls back to back to back to back to back to back to back I mean I guess it just depends on which bank that you work for um, and also keep in mind now I'm not sure if they're still doing this but I remember a while back when I worked at a bank this was like in the early 2000s y'all don't y'all don't hurt me okay I'm a, your girl is your girl is up there okay in age but um, they did require you to have a uh, decent credit okay so like nothing in collections that type of thing but you know it, it may be different now nowadays I haven't worked the last time I worked at a bank was like maybe 2008 so it may be different but I'm just throwing that out there okay so if you all are interested in these jobs please make sure that you see the links below I will leave the links below for these two jobs thank y'all so much for watching make sure um, if you guys are interested in this information make sure you subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video